Students, welcome to Arun Chandra Academy, DC School, Harbatia. I am Safiul Islam, headmaster of Arun Chandra Academy. Today I am going to teach you a uh, new subject, class seven, chapter number four, and the lesson is the praying hand. In this story, there is a family who lived uh, in a small place near Nuremberg, Nuremberg, a city of Germany. And that family, they have a, they have eighteen children. Among them, two of their brother who have a special talent uh, for art, and they wants to uh, become an artist. And they knew that their their financially very weak. Their father will not agree. And for that, they have taken out an idea. The first idea, let's see in the uh, text. Back in fifteenth century. In a tiny place near Nuremberg lived a family with 18 children. Back in 15th century. Century. Century means 100 years is called 1 century. Here is 15th century, that means 1500 years ago. 1500 years ago, in a tiny place. Tiny place, that means a small place near Nuremberg. I have told recently, Nuremberg, a city of Germany, lived a family with 18 years. In that place, in that small place, uh, a family lived with 18 children. In order merely to keep food on the table for this move, move, move here, move means rush or you can say crowd. The father and head of the household, a goldsmith by profession, worked almost 18 hours a day. That means the uh, household, the head of the family is professionally a goldsmith. And he used to work 18 hours a day. A day means a per day. At his trade and any other praying store he could find in the neighborhood. And apart from that, he used to work 18 hours per day. Apart from that, he used to work whatever he find in the neighborhood. Despite their seemingly hopeless condition, two of the elder children had a dream. In this struggle, in this uh, situation, hopeless condition, the, there are two brothers who have a uh, who had a dream. What the dreams? They both wanted to pursue their talent for art. They both want, wanted pursue means to utilize to utilize their talent for what for art. But they knew fully well that father uh, their father would never agree to send either of them to Nuremberg to study at the academy. And they knew that their father will not send them to the uh, Nuremberg, the study center of art school. They knew that. Why? Because they are very financially very weak. And here is the, uh, here is the word, word meaning. You can uh, see here also. The next page. After many long discussion at night in their crowded bed, the two boys finally worked out a pact. After a that means long discussion in, in night. In the India crowded bed, crowded bed, bed. Why this word used here? Because uh, in the family there are 20, uh, 18 children. There are 18 children. That's why the crowded used here. In the crowded bed at night, the two boys finally work out a pet. The two uh, two boys they are finally work out a pet. Pet means an agreement. They uh, they have an agreement. What's the agreement? They would toss a coin. They would toss a coin. You can see here, coin. The loser would go down. <coughs> sorry. The loser would go down into the nearby mines and, with his earnings, support his brother while he attend the academy. Who will lose lose that toss? Uh, he will work nearby mines. Mines means a hole at the where the gold, goldsmith used to work. The workplace. You can see here. This is the workplace of goldsmith. That means the loser, loser, uh, loser one will work nearby at the dead mines with, with his earnings, support his brother while he attend the academy. Whenever the, the owner brother, whenever uh, the owner brother uh, do study uh, in the academy, the loser brother will be supporting by his earnings. Then when that brother who owned the cross complete, completed his studies, in four years, he would support the other brother at the academy. That means whenever the who, who have win that toss, he will work at the at, at the academy. He will uh, train 
that academy and the loser one will help him. After four years, the, the story duration is four years. After four years, he would support the uh, other brother at the academy. He will uh, return back and support the other one who have lost. And uh, other with sense of his artwork. For their uh, for for his artwork. For their uh, for his artwork. And then or if necessary also by laboring in the mines and if it necessary he he have to work in the mines also in that mines also they toss the coin on a sunday morning after sir after uh, uh, sir in sunday morning they have had that toss after that albrecht durer the name of the brother one brother is called albrecht durer unda toss who have under toss albert durer under toss and went of nuremberg he uh, under toss and went went to went to the nuremberg albert and another brother name is albert the one is albert and another one is albrecht albrecht who have under uh, toss and albert who lost the toss went down the dangerous mines and uh, for the next four years he financed his brother whose work at the academy was almost an immediate sensation the loser brother albert he is uh, working in the mines for to help to help the uh, help the, help him his brother albert in that academy and in that academy was almost an immediate sensation in that academy he is an or almost an immediate sensation 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 means the ability to feel through your sense of touch it's called uh, sensation. Albert's itchings, his footers and his uh, walls were far better than those of most of his profession. The Albert who is uh, uh, taking training, uh, training in the uh, in the academy, his his works. Here is some words there like, like itchings, footers. Itching means the art art of objects. The art or objects. Footers mean a piece of wood that is for painting. Here you can see it is called a footcard. Albert reaching his woodcards and his and his oils were far better than those of most his professor. That means whatever Albert did, that is far better than his professor also. Not the students, his professor also. And by the time he graduated, he was beginning to earn considerable, considerable fees. For his uh, commissioned work, and after graduation, after completing his graduation, he used to uh, work and he earned uh, he used to work earn considerable fees also. When the young artist returned to his village, the Durer family had held a festive dinner uh, or here loan to celebrate Albert's uh, triumphant homecoming. Whenever the uh, Albert uh, come, uh, coming back to his uh, home, uh, uh, at that time only their father, the Durer family, had a festive dinner. Yeah, here is one word: their loan. Loan means a, an area of grass in a garden. In a garden is a certain area in a garden. That's called uh, loan. And they have a special dinner for uh, the coming back of his brother. This is the uh, story, and here is. Uh, Two pick up. I have given you the two two pick up and the rest part. I will start the next uh, next video. Thank you. Have a nice day.